Are you ready to start a successful career in sound healing? Or maybe you want to take your art to the next level by gaining more knowledge and practice. By watching this video till the end, you'll gain valuable insights that will help you to make a decision. Before taking the responsibility to heal with sound, you must understand what sound really is. Sound healing has become mainstream and the industry is blooming with software, gadgets, musical instruments, and schools. More and more sound healers are graduating with certificates. But there is often a big gap between being certified and having the skills to truly harmonize yourself and the world around you. Harmony has a mathematical foundation, but in practice, mathematics, music theory, and even the skills of deep listening don't appear in the curriculums of sound healing schools. To be confident in your art, it is crucial to becoming familiar with physics, music theory, application of sound healing instruments, as well as physiology and psychoacoustics. By learning these basic principles, you will create a practice built on integrity. My name is Gaia Irbader. For many years, I was seeking a practice that would help me become a better version of myself and that would bring benefits to others. In 2007, my path led me to the medicine plants and the sound of Himalayan singing bowls. It immediately appeared to me that I needed to learn why these instruments had such a powerful effect on the mind, body, and spirit. Finding such knowledge wasn't easy. I realized that 9 out of 10 schools were copying similar information about the relationship between modern Western music notes and ancient Eastern anatomy of chakras. Second octave, like a uh, root chakra, is based on the frequency. If we see this perfect C, perfect D, perfect E, we choose the bowls with the perfect note. Like if you are going to take the C bowl, so it's not C sharp or C, C you know, flat. We use the perfect C note bowl and based on the second oct musical octave. And the bowls are, you know, from incisors, 7 inches to 15 inches inside. I also questioned the idea of superior frequencies that were supposedly more healing than others. Gadget is called a love tuner. When I blow through this whistle, which I'll do in a moment, it creates a frequency, a sound frequency of 528 hertz, which is understood to be the frequency of love. In fact, it can even replace meditation if you don't have the time. I wanted to find the truth about how and why sound really affects the body, mind, and spirit. I decided to embark upon a comprehensive study of musicology, physics of sound, psychoacoustics, and physiology. I also deepened into the practice of conscious listening. Since 2010, I've conducted hundreds of sound journeys and shared my art with celebrities and politicians, kids and elders. I've brought the art of hypnotic sound to rehabilitation centers, nursing homes, businesses, martial arts schools, yoga studios, synagogues, AA groups, and medicine circles. I have witnessed and documented real miracles happening to my audience. My client's feedback has made me confident and motivated to share my expertise with you. Prior to coming up with the curriculum, I interviewed dozens of experienced sound healing practitioners asking them what is their weak spot, even after so many years of practice. In reality, some practitioners try to bring the audience to a state of harmony, not knowing whether their instruments or actions are harmonious. Yes, of course, you can play your singing balls and gongs just for fun. But when it comes to healing, please take it with responsibility and consider proper education. Our sound healing teacher's training course offers something that no other school does. It reveals the missing links and knowledge that will help you bypass the most common mistakes and inaccurate assumptions that even experienced sound healing facilitators make.
The class is designed for sound practitioners of all levels and those who want to transform and be confident creators of therapeutic arts. You will be led into the most subtle details of working with sound and will get answers to questions that would take you many years to master. Sound healing teacher training fits easily into your schedule. You can take lessons at any time, day or night. You get lifetime access to all the material, so you can revisit it anytime you want. Besides the written material, tables, videos, practical exercises and tests, I also offer mentoring by answering your questions that can be placed in the discussion window in every section. Here you can also read the comments of other students. That's not all. I'm delighted to meet my students over the phone or via Zoom to conclude each segment of the course. You'll receive personal feedback, creative insights, guidance, and my friendship if you wish. So what are you waiting for? Ring the bell. Still not ready? Please scroll down, check the curriculum and feedback from the circle of successful sound wellness artists that once were not sure like you are at this moment. For your convenience, some chapters of my programs are free to check. You just need to register to get access. If you feel like you would like to talk to me personally, please just give me a call, I'm available. I'm very much looking forward to seeing you in the class. I take this mission with humility, great honor and even greater responsibility.